guys and welcome to another Smock Boy Who or aka Smock Boy Who 29 review. I hope everyone is okay. I hope everyone likes my new logo. I I literally just found that logo. Um there is a great guy on Deed Art, I think I think the app's called, and literally he just he basically done the shape of basically of what the Doctor Who logo is. So literally I thought, do you know what? I like that one, I might use it. So basically guys Instead of diamond, I used that one. So guys, I hope you liked it, and I hope you all liked my new Smock Boy Who entry. Yes, I as that was my photo at the Toy Fate, as everyone knows I went to. So precap. I bet you're all looking at me now, right now, going precap. Yes. So as everyone probably remembers, I did a part one of my 14th Doctor's costume, and I showed everyone basically my version of the 14th Doctors. Well, the good news is, something came today, and I'm very happy that it did, because in a minute, I'm going to actually put it all on and show you what it is. But first, guys, let's have a recap. So, basically, guys, as you probably all remember, probably all know, that basically, as well, I also now have, and also, this is an update version as well, so in case people haven't seen my first part, please go and check it. If you haven't, stay here and watch number two because this bit is going to be very cool because I have literally now everything. So, actually, I'm kind of ruining the video. So, let's just go, let's just get on with the review. So, basically, guys, as everyone knows, I have the Sonic Screwdriver, the 14th Doctor Sonic Screwdriver. I am getting another one of these as well for me and my son. I am getting the actual other version of this as well, which I'm very, very looking forward to. And you know what? And also, this will be a review as well for the comparisons of both of these for the um, online version and also the non-line version one. So basically, I'm going to do a review on both of them and just to show you which one looks better. But to be honest, main people have already said for Comic-Con-wise and film Comic-Con, they have all said basically to take the the non the non online version one because literally like this one would probably just get scratched up and everything and that's kind of really what you don't want. But basically, I would take it with me to say like if I was meeting like famous doctors like Peter Peter um, Peter Davison or Sylvester McCoy or uh, any of the companions, then this is the one I would use to have the photos done with them. This is the one I would actually use. But Anyway, enough about that. Let's let's get on with the rest of it. Let's show you more updates that I've actually got as well. So my second update. Sorry guys, I have to lean over because mainly most of my stuff is there. So basically, also I do have the. Let me take these out. I also have the psychic paper. Yes, guys, I now have the psychic paper wallet. Um, the funny thing is, in here is my oyster card. So literally, I use my oyster card for this. So literally, when I saw the scene of David using it on the bus. Which was absolutely brilliant in one of the specials that he done. He just scanned it in on the bus. So literally, I decided, you know what? I'll use that as an idea. So literally, what is my Oyster card is behind there. I do use um, my other cards in here as well. So literally, I've just took two of my cards out as well. So literally, it can be a card holder, which is very, very good. And literally, my vision was in there too. So no offense. I take this everywhere with me now anyway. And I can use it like that. But to be honest, uh, until I get my new wallet, that's that's what it's going to be for use for now. So I have the, also the psychic paper. I also have the 14 Dr. Ty. No one's really going to bother about that. But I have the 14 Dr. Ty. And also, I have the Converses. Yes, I do actually have the Converses of the 14 Doctors. These are my favourite shoes. I'm really sorry they are dirty because I don't just wear them just to do cosplay because it's my first ever cosplay costume, guys. So I'm really, really nervous right now because I'm about to show you what it is. And yeah, as well. But also, pardon me. And also, I do have the 14th Doctor coat right now. But um, so I do have the 14th Doctor's coat, but that's going to be shown in a minute. So basically, something very nice came today. So, guys. I have it. Yes, I have the 14th Doctor's waistcoat and trousers. I'm very nervous. I've just dropped it. I'm very, very nervous because basically right now, um, I have ordered this in a small, so I'm very, very nervous right now how it's going to fit, how it's going to feel. So, let's find out. And I'm going to show you what it all looks like right now. And guys, we are back. Welcome. Right, so I'm not going to put it on yet because I have a very, very 
I have kind of a special surprise for you guys. So basically, let's start off first. So this is the waistcoat. It's very nice, and I got this from Cos Daddy. These are these are from Cos Daddy, guys. So literally, oh, it has pockets. I'm happy. It's got pockets. I can put my fucking watch on it now. I'm so excited, guys. I'm so sorry that I'm being a bit like over theatrical yeah but no i've heard of a lie this this literally just came like two minutes ago so literally i didn't have a clue what this comes with so this is the waistcoat and it actually is the cost daddy coat so literally guys from now on i i will admit this here and now um and i just want to say a massive thank you to my cousin gary and also to another guy called um who chaser i think his name is who chaser um he is a cosplayer person as well and basically um as you probably see in the flashing lights probably behind me or in front of me right now yes i am watching one of his videos as well because basically he's been helping me with my cosplays and literally um so you got the nice blue on the back as well which is very good and sorry i was just thanking him but basically he was one of the guys that actually made me find this so if it weren't for him i would never have found cost daddy and even to my cousin gary gary i want to thank you so much mate i really do appreciate it and i hope you're okay thank you very much Right, so the next one. So, it's not just the waistcoat I have. It's also the trousers. Yes, I have the trousers. The trousers actually look really nice. Yep, so the trousers look really, really nice as well. Um, I don't know how this is going to look after, but they look really big. Like, I look, they look, like, really, really big. Like, like, like I look fat. But, um, there's nothing wrong with fat people, but I, I'm okay. But, um, because I'm very skinny as well so i'm very nervous right now because i've just seen the length of these now so i'm very very nervous so do we dare do we see what it looks like let's find out how i look right now hello guys and we are back yes um so basically this is the whole costume and i think to be honest when you're back as well you it looks great so it kind of looks okay um so let's only say the one problem the trousers yes the trousers are completely and absolutely huge but that does not bother me at all because they come to the back of my actually they come to the back of my converses which is not too bad but basically what i will do is i will wear the suspend the um the things that people normally see me wear um, I will put them on. I don't know what colours I actually go with. Do I go with the blue or do I go with a black version? Or do I try and get another colour or do I try and find a brown version of the of like that as well? And which is very cool. Um, I love the way the costume looks, guys. I absolutely love it. And um, shall I finish off my costume piece now? What I would actually do if this was me myself. Um, two seconds, guys. Just one second because I have left one of the most prizes bits of this which is my pocket watch so basically i'm gonna put the pocket watch on here I'm so like guys i'm so happy with this costume i really really am happy with this costume i literally really am i'm actually happy with this costume so then i could put my pocket watch in there and there we have it so basically, this this would be another version that I'd like to do with my with my fourteen doctor. But now, shall we put it all together? Shall we put it all together, guys? I've I've been I've been really waiting for this for some time. I've been really really waiting for this now. So oh wow, well. wow, well. and there we have it, guys. I am the doctor. I look cool. I will admit that. It looks amazing. This is what I would wear if I also was going out in public as well. I'm not bothered about going out in public like this, to be honest. Like it looks really cool. I love I love my waistcoat. I love my suit. I am so so happy right now. And the other thing I've just found out as well, the waistcoats. Not the right length. But doesn't matter about that. Or have I missed Ah that's why that's why Ryan that's why, because Ryan's mucked it up. No, he hasn't, not really. Well, I kind of have, but but basically, there we go. Sorry, because the top button is normally the first one that he does up. And then he has the rest of it out, which is kind of cool. And to be honest, I have mucked up the tie, but my mum could probably help me with the tie. But also, guys, I do have another version that I could do. So, 
Does everyone remember the bio-regeneration part where he bio-regenerates? Yes, because I can actually pull that one off too. And I'm going to show you right now how I can. Let's go. And here we go, guys. Look, I have basically done the bio-regeneration version. So this top I got from Primark. And guys, I've just found out as well. Yes, I will have to wear the... Um, I think they're called North Suspenders. Um, the um breasts like the breast studs uh the breast um bands which which are called uh the braces that's it because who who chases to show me what they were so yes so guys basically i would have to wear um i would have to wear them with this costume so basically my trousers don't really fall um but what else can i say really about this costume i love it the cost daddy have done very well i'm so happy with them cost daddy thank you so much i'm very very proud of basically what they have done for me i'm so so happy as well and also i'm happy that it's got pockets i can actually put stuff in my pockets i'm so happy as well so guys this is the end of the review so will i do some photos in this costume yes i will because i will get my mum to do them i will get my mum to help me with the cost with the photos as well but guys all i want to say is now this has been fun like and subscribe to my channel so what is to come for my youtube channel right what is to come on the 24th of may i am going to another toy fate this one is in potter's bar it's the same toy fate i went to before but this one is in potter's bar and the guy has told me that he does do more doctor who stuff there in that one so i will be going to check that lot out and i will hopefully cross fingers be coming home with some bits also, as well, he, he did say in my last video that I did do. Um, so, if everyone did see... I'm sorry, guys, I have an itch. Um, but if you did see in the previous video, you did see that lovely, shiny 12th Dr. Sonic screwdriver. Now, he was selling that for £145. But he has made me a deal for it. So, will I be getting it as well? I might. I don't know yet. But I'm going to think about it. Next, um, basically as well, the 15th Doctor. Yes, guys, I will be trying to do my 15th Doctor Who cosplay as well. I will try and get the 15th Doctor costume if I can. Um, yeah, and then also I'm going to try and get the Masters costume. I already have one addition already to the Masters, which is the black suit and also the tie. Also, I have seen a very nice tyre that I actually do like that I will be using probably for the Masters tyre from now on. And it is, this is on easy as well. It's a lovely tyre and it's a Gallifreyan tyre. And literally it's got the Gallifreyan bit down the bottom of the tyre, which says um, the Doctor, I do believe, which looks very, very cool. And so I'm going to get that in black and silver. I think it's going to look really, really nice as well. And anything else to come no there is nothing else to come apart from if i do if any new doctor who stuff does come up with me then i will update you i will let you know in the comments and sections below but guys also i will say to you here and now please follow who who chaser please follow him because literally at the end of the day if it wasn't for him i would not have gone not got my cost daddy costumes and stuff and also i want to say a massive thank you as well to my cousin gary Gary, thank you so much for what you've done for me. Thank you so much for helping me with my Doctor Who cosplay stuff. And thank you for me again liking Doctor Who again. I am so happy again now. I know I'm nearly 30, but I'm happy again now that I'm loving Doctor Who again. And I'm going to keep going for Doctor Who now. Doctor Who now is now my hobby. I love Doctor Who. So guys, in time and relative dimension in space, I will see you all for the next review. And see you very soon. For time and relative dimension in space, see you guys very soon. Bye-bye.